Hey guys, it's Jake. In this video, I'll be going through how much money you realistically need to start a clothing brand. So there's a few basic things that you absolutely need to run a clothing brand. So expect to spend some money regardless. Then I'll go over some extra stuff that isn't necessarily needed, but could improve your business operations. And I'll give price summaries along the way so you get an idea of what these numbers look like. Also, my credentials are I started in 2017 selling one of one embroidered hoodies, then found local manufacturers, then overseas manufacturers, did bigger drops with 2000 plus orders hopefully you've seen my other videos been in this for about six years i know what you need to get the job done and real quick before we start people are making videos on how to start a brand with zero dollars as your budget no you need to spend money at least a few hundred dollars to appropriately get set up correctly don't rush until you have all the basics or not i don't care it's not my brand you need to buy things and spend money monthly also, I'll be going over the hardware and software stuff needed to just get started. To buy your first collection, a t-shirt with some color print on it should cost like $7 to $15, depending on the clothing blank used. And most printing places have a minimum of 30 to 50 units, so for a shirt with 30 units would cost $210 to $450. I recommend finding a print service near you on Google and asking them for a price sheet, and you can play around with the number. So first, the necessities, in no specific order. Poly mailer is about $19 per 100 count on Amazon for shipping your products. A website, $15 to $30 a month. I use and recommend Shopify. YouTube, how to set one up, it's not that hard, just takes a day or two to fully set up and understand the interface. Social media, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Discord, Twitter, Snapchat, etc. You want to make a digital presence. Use these social medias to show the public who you are, what you do, and why they should care about you. YouTube how to grow on these platforms. You don't have to use all of them. At least use Instagram and TikTok. Inventory versus pre-order method. Whether you want to buy inventory or if you run the pre-order method. You're a clothing brand. You need clothes to sell. I already have a video on pre-order versus inventory methods that go into more detail, but basically you either buy clothing first as inventory, then sell to customers, or you start accepting orders without inventory, then place production afterwards, then ship to customers once production is finished. A business plan, direction, purpose, something that at least puts your brand and creative processes on a track to go in a direction, ideally a direction you want to like and want to explore. This may take some trial and error, but you'll get it. With practice, you'll do great. Computer or tablet, price varies, I'd say $300 plus, Pretty mandatory for workflow and ease doesn't even have to be a beefy computer or tablet. Just enough to run your software and apps well and have medium large hard drive space. I recommend 250 gigabytes or more if possible. Softwares like Adobe Illustrator and Adobe Photoshop, but they can cost around 20 to 30 bucks a month or get Adobe Creative Suite for 54 bucks a month and you get every Adobe product, which I personally prefer or Affinity, Photopea, GIMP, any software you're comfortable with or you want to learn. So the total cost here is $319 fixed cost for poly mailers and computer slash tablet, and $35 to $84 per month for recurring subscriptions. Real quick, if you're thinking about starting a clothing brand or already trying to grow one, I highly recommend you check out my Seeks Vector mock-up pack. I recently added 89 new mock-up to the pack and it's the same price of $28. These mock-ups are fully customizable in Adobe Illustrator and are perfect for making tech packs to send to your manufacturers. I also have a manufacturer list on my website too if you're good on the designing part but don't know where to actually get the clothing made. Lastly, if you want to see testimonies from people who've previously bought my mock-up packs, check out my highlights on my Instagram, at BySeeks. Thousands of people love my mock-ups and I know you will too. Add over. Now that we covered the necessities, let's talk about some extra stuff that might help you. Label printer, $180, makes printing labels and packing slips so much easier. I recommend the Rollo brand thermal printer. Uses lasers to burn the labels, there's no ink, all you do is buy the shipping labels. Here is the printer and the shipping labels on Amazon. An email system, 20 bucks a month, but can scale to 50 bucks per month and even $300 per month, depending on how big your email list is and how many emails you send out per month. Like MailChimp or Klaviyo, you really should start collecting emails on your website so you can start sending emails out during key events for drop days, giveaways, sales, news, anything. Get the email list going. These do cost monthly depending on your email list size and amount of emails you send out. SMS system, 20 bucks a month. Same scaling as email system. Big lists can be expensive, but valuable. Like SMS bump or post script. Like the email system, start collecting phone numbers so you have even more ways to engage with your customers. 
also is a monthly subscription depending on SMS list size and amount of text you send out. Improved shipping system, 20 bucks a month like Shippo, ShipStation, Easy Ship, Pirate Ship, etc. Makes it so much easier to ship your packages, offers convenient user interfaces, cool bulk editing features that Shopify's UI doesn't offer, and really, really good discounts on shipping label prices. Friends, you gotta socialize a little bit and build rapport with people online, join discords, join subreddits, comment on other people's posts, join Instagram group chats, those are nice. Make friends, share ideas, have accountability, spend time and conversation with people who share your interests. Instagram and Facebook ads depends on how often you want to run ads and how much money per day. You can do $5 per day or $10 per day or $50 per day for three days if you're dropping clothes during that time. All up to you and very flexible. Running ads for any business is incredibly helpful if you run them correctly. There are tons of videos on YouTube that explain how to do this. It's tough, but you need to practice. I highly recommend you look into this and figure out how to get good at digitally marketing your brand. Buy books, watch videos, put in the work. So the total cost here is $180 fixed cost for the Rolo printer and $210 to $400 per month for recurring subscriptions, assuming you're running cheap $10 per day ads for 15 days out of the month, so $150 a month for the ads. If you add necessities and extras together, it's $499 fixed cost and $245 to $484 per month for the recurring subscriptions. Also, I'm not taking into account sales tax and income tax or cost of paying an LLC or some other business type. Those vary and are important too, but you should focus on setting up your business correctly, then think about those things as you grow. There are tons of videos on YouTube that explain those things and how much they cost. You may have none of these things or some of these things, and these aren't even a fraction of all possible things one needs to be a successful clothing brand or business. But if you don't have all of these essentials, you're putting yourself at a slight disadvantage compared to your peers, so keep that in mind. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe if you haven't already, and check out my brands and my digital assets, all will be linked in the description below. See ya.